What's up guys, welcome to the Macintosh Review. Today I wanted to cover some of the latest Apple news that's been floating around involving iOS 10.2.1 and Luca Tedesco, and I just wanted to clear a few things up regarding jailbreak applications, so let's jump right into it. So first off, I am going to show you guys how to install jailbreak apps on your device in this video, but I wanted to clear up a few Apple related news items before I begin. So iOS 10.2.1 as of today, January 18th, is nowhere to be found. We've gotten the public beta release of beta 4 from Apple on January 14th, but there has been no public official release despite the fact that all of us thought it would be available earlier this week. The iOS 10.2.1 release in reality is just a bit of a mess guys. I honestly have no idea what they are doing or really when it will be released at this point. So from my point of view guys, I guess we just have to wait and play the waiting game. I honestly don't have better news about it, unfortunately. Along with the waiting game for iOS 10.2.1 is the waiting game for the stable iOS 10.2 and 10.1.1 jailbreak. Now I've heard rumors today that Luca Tedesco, the developer of the jailbreak, has officially begun working for an Apple bug bounty program where Apple would pay him directly to report the bugs that he finds in iOS if he reports them directly to them. And obviously this would not be good news for the jailbreak. I'm not really sure how true this is, as Luca did tweet on his Twitter profile on January 7th that he will be producing an iOS 10.2 jailbreak, as you guys can see right here. But in reality, I think we just have to wait this one out as well. I'm not really fully believing the rumor, but there's not really any other confirmation until we see what develops moving forward. It just seems very odd to me that he would tweet that a couple of weeks ago and now he's working for Apple. I mean, I, I just don't really see the two and two going together. Also, this rumor has only been posted on a few websites, not really that many, so until it makes the mainstream websites, until we know that it's true, I'm gonna take this one with a grain of salt. Anyway, I'm sure you guys are in the same boat as me, that with all of this iOS 10.2.1 and the jailbreak dilemmas and rumors and all this craziness going on, you are actually a little bit frustrated, a little bit annoyed. Well, I just wanted to remind you guys that there are ways that you can install jailbreak apps on your device without even jailbreaking, and these methods even work on iOS 10.2.1. You can install tweaked apps, you can install emulators, you can install screen recorders, and more, and it is really super simple process to install guys. You don't even need Cydia or a jailbreak. And as you guys can see, I have many of these applications installed right here on my iPhone 6. So two of the apps that I have installed here on my iPhone 6 that did allow me to install all of these jailbreak apps are Zestia and Tweakbox, these two icons at the bottom of my screen right here. I've done videos on both of these in the past and the same installation process applies. I will put those guides and those videos down there in the description for those of you who have not seen them and for those of you who are looking for a way to install jailbreak apps on your device without jailbreaking. It really just requires a download of a profile from Safari, super easy guys. So go ahead and check out those guides if you do wanna follow them to install these jailbreak apps. I'm hoping that these methods really ease the anxiety of waiting for a jailbreak in the iOS 10.2.1 release. Believe me guys, I'm right there with you. I'm really annoyed by the whole delay. I hate it when Apple does stuff like this and there's just rumors everywhere and we don't know what's going on. Very, very frustrating. Back in the day, this is what jailbreaking usually was like. It was a whole cat and mouse game between the developers and Apple. So kind of brings me back then in a bad way way so I'm right there with you guys with the frustration so hoping these guides help you guys out and ease some of that frustration anyway if you did like this video be sure to subscribe and click the like button I will be posting more information as it is released I will also have my social networks and my website down in the description for you guys to connect with me so go ahead and check those out as always thank you for watching stay awesome and I will catch you guys in the next video hopefully with some better news thank you and peace out